Connor, what's one Pokemon you wouldn't want to be real? Um, <laughs> that I wouldn't want to be real. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to make you sad. <laughs> <laughs> you seem so concerned about this question. You can make, you can make them all real it. if you want. I'm sorry. I want them all real, Charlie. Yeah, but I like, what's one real. that like you'd be like you'd run in the opposite direction <laughs> as soon as you saw it? It's like a quantum question. It's not a quiz. Like, there's options. It's, <laughs> there's so a big, of, like, it's like a one thousand multiple choice. There's a lot of main ones. I think um. Drifloon, I think. Really? Because that one like kidnaps Takes little kids, kids and then like yeah. kills them. Mm -hmm. So like I, I don't want the kids to die. Yeah, that would suck if people started doing that. But um, if I had to take all the Pokemon being real, like to get any of them real, I would do it. And okay. so then the kids would like die. the good outweighs though. Yeah, like you would. So you would let those kids get like lifted off. Right. It's for the good of mankind. Can you imagine? Did you ever like let a balloon go when you were a kid and like just watch it That's, go? That that feeling is the saddest feeling. Can you imagine if that was your child instead? Like you can't like get them. They just go. What are you talking about? A child turning about... into a balloon and then floating away. Yeah. And you're the parent. Of no, like a balloon what? taking your child. Have you ever? Okay. Well, I mean, I understand. Yeah. That whole thing. You understand I mean, the feeling. Now imagine instead of your child being a balloon, imagine they're hit by a car on the 405 at 9.32 p.m. on Friday night. Ooh, a little then, bit uh, of a, a little bit of a, let's shift this to uh, to your crimes thing. I see Well, I mean, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Why don't you answer Charlie's question? Let's, uh, yeah, let's pivot, just like they should have pivoted out of the way. Into the other lane, Into the other perhaps, lane, yeah. but they didn't. They didn't. No. Let's get if your child was again. a balloon. That was not even, <laughs> that was like never. If your child was a balloon, what question. are you going to do? What are you gonna do? Cause they're gonna pop. Are this you gonna is like this is like when let them free. This is like when live? you get. A, are you still gonna love me if I was a worm? No, no, I'm not. Wait, 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 I go, th I go you? through that. I had this question. conversation with Grace. I go like, through that question situation with Chase. So many yeah. god. Are you, you gonna love this? me if I'm a worm? If I if I'm just a, if I am if a. You, you ask it like it's a silly question. Would what would you, would your girlfriend still love you if you were a worm? Um, I think so. Yes, but. It's funny that you say that because she asked me if I turned into a mosquito, but I was still me, what would you do? And I was like, I learned very quickly after these questions kept happening. Because ri it, it's rigged. Unless you, it's a rigged question. Yeah. Unless you answer with, I would still love you. I would put a... I'd put you in a jar and I'd and I'd a go jar? to and you'd put your girlfriend well, in a jar. I don't want to. I don't want to. What the fuck? She's your a girlfriend. She she'll is, die. This is exactly she why this question. Blood, she, you, you need to let her suck on, on that little bloody. Let her bloody. suck on you, Ted. You gotta get her in there. The little fucking. Well, no. Pores. What I would do is I'd I'd put her in a dress. She doesn't fly away, assuming that she like is a mosquito and doesn't have like the is doesn't have full sentience. And then she's every and then every you know every other day or something, I'd come and I'd I'd go. With the blood, Ooh. oh my god! I cut my palm? hand you'd, into you'd the jar. Drown it. Yeah, probably she'd drown probably it overdose. Well, because because well, you know why? Because she added an, an additional thing. Strength to grow. She <laughs> added an additional thing where it was like, what if I was a mosquito and I I was carrying every mosquito born disease. <laughs> Like malaria oh and the God. Zika virus. This is what she had. This is a conversation we had. Yeah. And she was like, would you let me suck your blood? <laughs> this is ridiculous. And, well, what, what did you and I said, that's how I solved that. I was like, okay, I'll, I'll catch you. I'll put you in a jar like, and donate. then I'll give you blood from yeah, here. So it won't IV. go into my system. I won't get the virus, but I'll still be able to keep you alive. And then I'll figure out how to, how to turn you back. And you'll figure out how to actually have a loving relationship as well. Let me pose Because you. you're not going to love a mosquito. No, I'm gonna figure out how to turn the mosquito back. You, Just you gotta you understand. Wouldn't love this a is mosquito. how you answer the question, all right? It the, the question always has to be based in you. You're already are, a little blood sucker, aren't you? The question is just about getting that sort of um, reciprocation, no matter what. Actually, it's not. What? Here's the thing. Grace asked me this too. Actually, I think I posed it to her too because I argued like with the boys about this for hours. Um, any quick nose, you got to get out of the way, you know. But it's like. If you woke up one day in bed and next to you where your girlfriend was was a worm, first of all, an insane jump in logic to think that your girlfriend had turned into a worm. Unless you saw her turn into a worm, but yeah. I'm getting to the same no, I'm getting to the same place. Yeah. Because at the end of the day, if you figure out like you're like, I'm calling like all her family, like where is she? Oh my god, all that's there is a worm. Like there's not even worms aren't even in season. How did this worm get here? What is Holy worm shit. season? I'm like, wiggle at me. And then she does. And I'm like, holy fuck. It's worm season. Um, wiggle at me? Yeah. Well, how else is the worm going to No, no, no. Okay. But here's the thing. I would quit my job 
and I would find who did it. Because if there's a, pre like if this happens, right? If suddenly my girlfriend turned into a worm, I would go, I would stop at nothing to find out who turned my girlfriend into a worm. What source of like worm magic exists yeah. so that people can be turned into worms? Because it's a this big is like, th yeah. this opens a whole can of. <gasps> was Welcome to Chuckle Sandwich. <laughs> I like that. But now, no, get, but this, get this, put this in your pipe and maybe smoke on it a little bit. You take your girlfriend, you, you karate chopper. Two, two girlfriends. girlfriends. <laughs> a double girl. I don't feel like you want so to turn The worm would live, back. though. The worm would live. How, how, what happens when you turn her back, though? And then you've got like two. two. Is it? Then she's one of those conjoined no, <laughs> twins with two no, heads. That's horrifying. Why that's is like that your first thought? Yeah. <laughs> that's so much worse <laughs> than anything you could have said. Why did you go there? What did you say? No, but like, what do you say before you trap your girlfriend in half as a worm? <laughs> like, Hasta la vista? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> like, no, you're not going to do that. I want two of you. <laughs> two I don't half. fucking know. Two is better than one. Slice. <laughs> See, that'd be terrible. Like, if I'm the one that gets turned into the worm and I'm trying to communicate, like, I am the worm. Like, I, like, help. And then you start going, like, I'm going to chop you I'm in cut half. Cut you in half. I like, love you so much. Stand still. Like, how do you communicate? Stop. Like, I'm wiggling. Is that does that mean yes? Does that mean cut me in half? Yeah, you could have like a little wiggle language. I just think it's alarming that your first thought, if your girlfriend is morphed into a mosquito, was to keep her in a jar forever instead of like. Well, no. Okay, but what what happens if the worm like? What would you do if Grace turned into a worm? Mm -hmm. I'd get like You're a big like dirt terrarium thing. That's like the same thing as putting her yeah, in a jar. Well, yeah, but you didn't say you, you didn't say you'd like find the guy that did you it. You get like thing. maybe still I literally water. said that. I said I would put I would I would put her in the jar and then I'd figure out how to turn her back. I would go to the he best scientist. That. No. Yeah, he did say that. No. He did say what that. What are you talking about? I don't think so. I don't think so. I'd I just know. leave. Okay. I'm sorry. You're you're a worm. <laughs> you're not sorry <laughs> though. That's the whole that's the whole crux of what you're saying. You're not sorry. I wouldn't be sorry. Would you just like open a window and then like walk out of the house? I'd be like, why the fuck? Find your own way. Ew, it's a fucking worm. <laughs> She's not gonna communicate to me, like put it in your mouth, go will stash. So, <laughs> 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 um, I'll tell you what the first thing that was asked though in this line of questioning, because mm -hmm. this was a whole, you know, line of questioning that it would a new one would happen every day. But the first one was she asked, "What if I, you watched me turn into a pineapple, and I started to float away?" What the what fuck? The hell? Is your, does your girlfriend do like heavy drugs? <laughs> no, but we smoke weed every now and then. Ooh. But this always almost comes up sober. My God, they Damn. do. They do. Wow. Yeah, remember that dare person came up to us at that breakfast? Was, yeah, we had a we had a true. dare person. That was a yeah. fun. That's a funny story. Okay, yeah. So when we went to uh, we went to Porto's, the place at Freddie W. Yes. Should I am I allowed to say that? Yeah, yeah. yeah oh, but okay. at this point, at this point, that episode is up already. It's LA. Everyone's everywhere. Yeah. Uh, we went we went to Porto's. We got the little potato things. We got the little chicken things. And on the way in, there was a booth for Dare, which was like the school program for the like Dare to Dare to not Dare to don't do dare drugs. To, dare, dare to you don't stay do sober. Them. I dare you to not. Demon, yeah. angry, Ritalin, evil. Just about Ritalin. Drugs yes. are really, really exciting. exciting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but um, they or were epic. Or epic. Or epic sauce. Mm. Doormats, airplanes, airplanes. Rhinos. rhinos. Elephants. elephants. <laughs> <laughs> Those are four different the animals. The four food groups. <laughs> Um, no, but they were out there, and that was a thing. Um, oh my God, people watching this might not have grown up with with it's Dare. True, it's true. Um, yeah, it was like a you weird a breakdown of what it is. Yeah, yeah, I can break it down. I can break it down, nice. uh, PUBG style. Dude. Um, it was like a um, I don't fucking remember, but the whole thing was like don't do. It was just like don't do drugs. It was like Dare to it, say it no. It wasn't like just that. It wasn't that innocent though. It was like guys don't. It was like more like. You will go to hell, your parents will die, and you will lose all your jobs no matter what if you do weed once. That's kind of like what Dare was. I kind of like that. That was a really yeah. good baseline, by the way. Thank you. I, I yeah, didn't I like really that. have Dare because I, I went to like a... Are, oh, so you're high? Yeah. Well, no, I went you're to like a, a, a Christian school, and so they didn't oh, really man. need the oh. like the, those services. Jesus it was is just all you like, needed, yeah. Yeah, yeah it's, you only needed Jesus, and if you were doing drugs at all, like you're gone. Like You can't be there anymore. You're gone. You're, you're gone instantly. Gone. Instant evaporation. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. One of my friend's brothers like, was like caught with weed during yeah. 
that we had like a church service every week at, mm. at school. Oh, we got caught at church with in weed? the bathroom during church oh God, doing geez. weed, and then he was kicked out of school. And like everybody like shamed them. They were like, "Oh my God, like I can't believe." What does that? Like, what does that mean, shaming though? Well, this is like everybody, everybody looked at a. So the kid's brother was in my grade, and yeah. it was like talking about like, "Wow, his brother like did weed like and got kicked out. Like oh that's my bad." God. Oh my yeah. God. I remember being there thinking like, "It was like weed. Like it's not like he like did like meth." Like he was just smoking. Yeah, you were weed. like cooler than everyone. No, else. Yeah. but you don't understand, Connor. If there's one thing Dare taught me, it's that weed is the gateway it's to the gateway drug. Yeah. The bad. Yeah, yeah. Do you remember that? That do was that? the the really the crux. Yeah, I keep saying crux today. That was really the okay. the the whole centerpiece of what Dare was talking about with the gateway drugs, wasn't it? It was. That's what it? I feel like it was. Where is the gateway? Well, usually to hell. Yeah. Yeah. Do you think so? Like a priest can bless water, right, and make it like holy water. It's like yeah. they do. Yeah, yeah generally yeah. it's just normal water. Could they just like bless anything. They bless the funny little bread. They bless the funny little bread. And they it bless becomes the water. Jesus. Yeah, they yes. they bless the the. They have a specific cracker too. They could just take a. They could just bring out a box of club crackers, and it would still work. That is a. That is no. That's and it would have been a. Well, it would have been a marginally well, enjoyable. Know. Well, more maybe enjoy- maybe a Calvinist could. Or maybe oh. like a Baptist could do club nice. and pretend like that works, but I mean it's a very serious process of baking mm-hmm. the cracker without yeast, and it does the bread doesn't rise and it stays thin and like the body of Jesus when he was is, on that is, cross. Is Jesus a yeastless? Yeah, no, Jesus didn't have yeast in didn't him. Didn't have any yeast in him. He didn't have yeast. Do you ever him. talk about this kind of stuff? And like whether he had yeast. Yeah, like yeah. If Jesus. What did was you like learn? A, ye- a yeastly guy. What did I learn? Yeah. Like about what? Oh, like just well, you, you grew up. Was this a this was a um, Protestant it was, upbringing. It was non-denominational. So, like what they would do Jesus is Jesus Christ. They man. would try don't, to. Don't. Oh okay. my God. They would try to bring in as many people as I suppose they could. Really? Yes. But, but, did, but uh, that were within the Christian faith. Mm, mm. I did uh, like a. It wasn't really Bible school or anything, but it was like Unitarian Universalist. <laughs> we like yeah. went to. D- d- you know See, what? They it wouldn't was even great. Teach us. We went to other religions, and we and we. Why, and we saw what gay sex was. Oh. They told us that. Oh, that's okay. that sucks. Yeah, no, we didn't learn that. <laughs> <laughs> that sucked. <laughs> Jeez, <laughs> Connor. <laughs> wow. They didn't, happy sex. they didn't teach us about that. Wait, gay is like what you happy, are happy when you sex? get close to God. You gay get happy. Gay yeah. is what you are. <laughs> yes, I'm gay. <laughs> Shouldn't you be happy when you're having sex? Yeah. Well, they were happy the two sex. men. <laughs> happy <laughs> sex. Happy sex. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, we didn't learn about the other denominations because I think that would have caused some rifts. It was just kind of like, like four or five or six or something like that. Yeah, it was just, well, mm-hmm. instead of like, there was no Calvinism or baptism. I thought that was good. Yeah, it was fine. It was just like, like this is this is what you do. You just read the Bible. And I was like, it's just it so Bible specific? Pretty Bible, yeah, very Bible centric. Are, are you a religious person now or has it? Uh, I mean, I don't really know. I guess I'm pretty agnostic now, mm. I would say. Yeah. I, would, I think it's like a part of me. I just grew up with it so much that it's like very much a part of my <laughs> so identity. Mad. That's honestly... So the, I, I guess I'm still somewhat, but I don't know. That's honestly the the easiest route, in my opinion, is 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 just the agnostic route, especially because if you don't really think about it too much, and it's like... Because for a while when I, you know, I was raised Catholic and, yeah, you know... Coward's way. I, yes. I, I, I was very often... <laughs> I was very often not a fan of going to you know church other than you know going to uh, uh, going to the bakery after where they had these really good cookies. Mm. Um, but at a certain for a, a little bit, like when my teenage years, I was like, I'm an atheist. I'm I'm nothing exists. And it See, was. I never went there because I would like to go to heaven. Uh, yeah, well, Ooh, it's one yeah. of those things too, where it's did like. Did you guys ever know athe- any aggressive atheists? Like anyone who was like, I'm the amazing so yeah. yeah, I was going to say. Oh, there is that really one amazing atheist. <laughs> yeah. 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 He was yeah. amazing. Yeah, that's what I mean, though. Like, with the with what you're saying right there is, like, atheism does feel like an aggressive. It is sort of it's aggressive. It's not an aggressive thing, but, like, people people that make it their whole thing to, like, be mad at yeah. people that are religious. It's whereas, like, like, I feel like you're missing the point, yeah. right? Like, whereas if, you're, if you're, like, choosing not to participate in it, why are you getting on other people for having their own? Things. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Whereas agnostic is just like if there's something. The, the ooh, Unitarian yeah. is coming it's, it's out. It's kind of like if you own an <laughs> Xbox and someone other. else owns a PlayStation, and you get all mad at them for not buying the Xbox. Right. Do you think uh, which side of the console wars do you think oh, God was, is on? Oh, Xbox. You think yeah, God is the Xbox is the the better one? It's the American console. It, it, and God it just, loves America. <laughs> oh, that's good. When wow. you when you 
plug in the Xbox and it makes boop boop. It just kind of makes sense, right? You know, yeah. And then the PS4 or like whatever that whole shit is, mm-hmm. it's no. just it just doesn't feel right. No, and it's you know it's not it, right deep it's down. Not right. It's not when right. When you turn on the Xbox, it feels like like worse. I want to pray. In the room. Yeah, when yeah. I turn on the Xbox, yeah. I want to pray. Yeah. I'd suck Phil Spencer off for yeah for sixty days of of uh, Xbox Live. Gold. He's a good man. He's a good yeah. man. Mm-hmm. Have you ever gotten the Red Ring of Death? I did. I did on my really? Xbox. Mm. Yeah. Either of you guys gotten it? No. I didn't ever. I had like an Xbox for thirty minutes as a kid. I had. What? Thirty, 30 minutes? minutes? Yeah. Until it wrecked me. What does that, that mean? I don't know. You gotta, so you just said that I without only, really knowing. No, what I think you were I only saying. like really used it for thirty minutes. It was like one of those situations where I had like a I had like a Wii too, and it was with my brother, and we played like we got like a Modern Warfare three Xbox or maybe two Xbox and. It was like had the camo. I'm having trouble. Two Xbox. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, having, Xbox I'm having trouble. Two one Xbox. Xbox. Two Xbox. Wii, Wii two. Yeah, yeah, we, yeah, we yeah Wii, Wii, Wii U. Wii U. Nintendo Land though. U X. Nintendo Land on the Wii U yes. was pretty cool. That was good. Yeah. I, I had um, when I was growing up, I had an Xbox 360, and my parents for the longest time they put parental controls. Oh. on Ooh, the Xbox yeah, I had that. and I had a two hour limit Ooh. so like when they'd go away for like a weekend or something I had a lot of time I'd have to be like can you guys turn it off just for me and that's how I would play Total Miner I'd play Total Miner for like uh, eight hours because the parental controls were off shit. could you hear people in game or did that was that off too Oh no! You could hear people in game. It was quite literally it just, just filters like, them. Like, <laughs> 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 it sounded like, sound like glip. It was. <laughs> it was quite literally just like my parents being like, wanted me to not be on it for as long, so they limited the amount of time. Like, it, could so you play M games. You, you what? Could you play M games? Yeah, yeah, I oh, could. Oh yeah, of course. No, I, I, I could. I could play like just the terrible, terrible games. It was the amount of time that I was spending that was what yeah. what was mm. irked my parents well, the why most. Why was blood such a big factor for so many parents? It was always like, does this game well, have blood? Dude, well, here's why. Because this? if you spend only an hour and 59 minutes murdering police officers in Grand Theft Auto V, then that doesn't seep into your head. But it's one just Grand Theft Auto was probably one that took me a little while to be able to... Uh, have access to, I think. Mm. But honestly, it, it was only like I remember. I do. You know what? I do actually remember convincing my parents to let me get Red Dead Redemption because I was like, it's like a historical lesson. <laughs> it's it's about an era that I've never learned about before, and playing this game will teach me about the cowboy you gotta have an era. Angle. Honestly, yes. You gotta have an angle. Modern Warfare Two. It. Uh, you want to learn about the airport? Yeah. Yep. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, of course. You want to learn you what it learn means. Airport, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, like play how, level how level to go level through level security again. faster than you normally would. Yeah, man, that black screen. You hear the <laughs> load. Hear the loading. Snobby boch. No Russian. Did you cry when they betrayed you at the end? No, I did. I didn't know what was going on. I, I didn't think our first military servicemen would turn our be- turn their backs. Yeah, it's well, not I nice skipped. Enough. Here's what I did. I skipped the cutscenes at first when I was like, <laughs> why? <laughs> Cause boring, you dumb, cause dumb boring. Kid. I was in seventh grade. I was like, in, I was in middle school mm. when I got access to that game. He's got to get to the airport mission. He's skin, skipping ahead. Yeah, well, I, I wanted to see. I wanted to get into the game, right? Like, I don't like cutscenes and bullshit like that. So I skipped right ahead, and I was just like, all right, cool. I'm part of this. And then they shot me at the end. And I was like, what the hell? Come I was on, with you guys. all the way. I was, I was just Team as excited. Kill. Yeah. Yeah. Speaking of campaigns, you had that Freddie Long episode already come out. And he was on here saying how he thought the Halo campaign was. Do you want to rebuttal? Good. I have a bit of a rebuttal. Okay, please. Light First of all, us. he was incorrect on some things. Okay. Uh, yeah. The grunts did not speak any comedic sense until Halo Three. Mm. Uh, so in the original two games, what that is do? true. They, they they did speak in like an other different yeah, language. They didn't speak English. Can I hear like what a grunt like one like a one? They were That's kind of funny. But they weren't like all like. Kitty and funny until like until the third game. Okay. Um, also, Master Chief is an American. He's, he's from not diff- American. He's from a different planet. He's from, he's from a. Planet. He's from, a, oh. he's from a, a colonized planet. Also, he's there's no America yeah. technically. So like they, American where they name it's every, the UNSC they name people like well, John, America right? became everywhere because well, America, the United <laughs> no, Nations, now it's, the United, now it's going your the United Nations alive. turned into <laughs> like <laughs> the, the United Nations turned into like Earth in general, like Earth like. Totally, but with, the the capital of America centric. The capital of Earth is New Mombasa. Mm. I'm pretty sure, right? Yeah, that was like a, we gave that to them, but America. What? America. We. <laughs> okay. Um, so Master Chief, like, 
Yeah. I feel like that's just unrealistic. I feel like if anybody is going to be Earth soon, it's going to be China. Really? Well, this is this is you know, this is like five hundred years into the future. Yeah. So we oh, don't know yeah. what's going to no, go on there. They'll have it. Yeah. They'll have it. Yeah. This goes against everything that's been part of your brand. I think it's just no. I, mean, I just I just think China will ha- will have the manpower and the right to uh, the right. The right. What? <laughs> Dude, did you get, like what happened? What's your new sponsor? Yeah, did someone <laughs> put like a little chip in your head? No, I'm good, man. You like Valorant? <laughs> I got Bing <laughs> 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 Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Bing Chilling. What are you saying? <laughs> oh, you're just speaking gibberish and then saying no, Bing Chilling. No, I'm not. No, Scott, I'm not. Put, you, put there's no way that you memorize the Chinese. Oh, Shen Hao Zhong Wu. What does that mean? I don't know. I'm kind of worried. What is he saying? I, is is he just not saying? But I don't want to. I don't know. Put, I don't want to say to cut it out. You put John yeah. Cena on my. Oh on the no! Other side oh and, uh, no! It'll line up perfectly with what I'm saying. Okay. And you need the vine boom sound effects. Connor, do you have any words you'd like to put out there for China? Um. I, see, here's an. Can I just say this thing first? Before Connor goes into this, it's interesting because these podcasts are being released like several weeks later, but <laughs> the world is lo- is currently in like a what's gonna happen thing. So this could be released after like we should some- oh we should say something like it's happened. We should say something like it's happened. Yeah, you um, make some predictions. Yeah, yeah, did you guys see the the grunt outside today <laughs> running around? <laughs> so I never thought they'd be so early. Five hundred years. English. I never yeah. realized. Speaking English. Yeah. Seriously, I want to go to New Crane. <laughs> 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 Can't wait to <laughs> visit the, <laughs> the, new, the new Ukraine, the Chinese yeah. city of ta- Taiwan. Mm. <laughs> oh, so I'm glad we're next Mexico City. I think that it's gonna be a cool <laughs> place for us. <laughs> um, what else can we do? I can't um, wait to visit the uh, the uh, the state of Ontario. That'd be kind of crazy if, like, we just sort of like let's go just go take Ottawa. The rest of this. Yeah, listen, bro. I, this is what I've been saying, right? Like, Putin doing the Ukraine thing, Xi Jinping doing the Taiwan thing, maybe the Hong Kong thing. It's our turn. Let's take the hat. What uh, what what thing do you want? The hat, the America's hat, dude. Oh, Canada. Yeah, man. Oh, I yeah, see. Man. I see. I mean, they're okay up there. What if we just mm. kept going west? Fuck nice. the dolphins, bro. Into the ocean, man. Yeah. Oh, they're not. We already did that. We took gonna Hawaii. Do? What are they gonna stop us? We already took Hawaii. That's like what's west. That's what's west. That's yeah. what's west. I want the fish yeah. too. Though, that's the thing. You want the fish? I want the fish. I'd rather have the, the Canadians though. Than the fish? Yes. Why don't we have uh-huh. high speed rail yet? That's my question. Mm. It's because we did actually we first. actually we just got one yesterday. What? Yep. Oh yeah, no, that's true. <laughs> it's like a month later. <laughs> 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 Be the the greatest like infrastructure like movement in well, the history of the country exciting. well everything sucks because we did it first huh yeah we, we don't have any magnetic made, speedway we rails made, we made the internet okay so we're we're on the outdated there is a reason why our t- our phone numbers are one one yeah cause one yeah i guess but yeah i mean connor what's your allegiance my allegiance yeah america Nice, okay. nice. That's good. Yeah, that's we, good. This is an American that. podcast. Mm-hmm. We like to hear that. No. We like <laughs> to hear <laughs> that. From, There's you've, been talks. You've changed. I haven't changed. You've, you've changed. changed. He's not wearing his New York hat. He's, he's wearing he's wearing a big dude. His big dude oh, his hat. Big dude. China's a bit of a big dude right now. Yeah, it's a big country. So Connor, um, if you could kill or make a certain Pokemon species extinct like if <laughs> like Pokemon? if you could just like kill them off like brutally like not like oh i decide this doesn't exist more like an actual effort within I, the world of pokemon to get guns Ted, and similar to, to how they this. did the australian war versus the emus, the emus. Um, yeah. i don't want to eradicate any of the pokemon no no but if you had to make a choice that's so Terrible. Well, listen. I oh, mean, sure. It's, it's terrible. You were the lions, right? Yeah. 
Okay, well. Ooh, what's your what's your take on this lion thing? You know the lion. Okay, so yeah, I have to ask it. It is people haven't heard it. Wait, wait, just real quick. So easily answered. All original. It's all original. 151, right? No, I mean, or is it different? Most people now just say it's every Pokemon. Every Pokemon. There's like 900 of them. Yeah, but then as the versus one billion lions. It's like oh, we got gods. We got we got. Yeah. yeah. So here's uh, the lions. We you were you made a guest appearance, a cameo on a previous episode of Chuckle Sandwich to talk about this. I am adamant about this. And 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 also huge Pokemon. That's in nature. A lot. I have knowledge of this. And there's another thing too. A lot of I remember seeing a little bit of a fan cam too when you showed up and you were you were showing the water bottle. The water yeah, cup. Yeah, they like that. When you had the mm-hmm, water cup. Mm-hmm, yeah. mm-hmm. So this is actually kind of a big deal. Um, this is a big deal for me, dude. I keep seeing you. You're always lurking there in the am. back of Chuckle Sandwich. You're always in the shadows there. You're always it's moving true. back and forth. And you know how Charlie loves his shadow gone. beast. Yeah, I does. do love my shadow beast. And so it's so good to see one of them finally come out into I know. the light. Connor. Yeah, people have been asking. He's not crazy. I know. And we're so happy. I don't know. What's that? But anyways. <laughs> <laughs> anyways. Yeah, the, no. It, my answer is the lions. <laughs> really? A thousand percent. Wow. It's a Pokemon fan, it's too. It's a billion lions. Wait, Scott, it's, play like an audience noise of them being like shocked. <gasps> we then, knew his answer. Scott, he play. came on and, and said this whole spiel. Oh, I no, I, I didn't Scott, the, play I didn't sounds the of, the, of lions mauling the audience <laughs> until it's silence. It's, it's very simple. Okay. Sound. You have to have a consistent rule set, right? Wow. For the Pokemon. Okay. Otherwise, you can just be like, oh, well, one's a god. He just wins whatever. What's the rule set, then? Well, you, you go by the games. They can only use a certain amount of moves. Okay. And they have a certain amount of health. And there's no implication that they have, you know, a trainer that's going to be there to heal them or anything like okay. that. Okay. SP so points. Eventually, is that what it's called? SP yeah, points. Eventually, P- I think PP. It's called PP. PP. PP points. PP points. Yeah, that's good. Nice, eventually, nice they're going to run out of energy. Nice job, they're going to run out of power. So listen, I'm not saying that Pokemon won't kill, dare I say, hundreds of millions of lions. There's going to be a lot of carnage out there. But by the end bodies. of the battle, there's a billion lions. The po- 900 Pokemon aren't going to be able to make it. Okay, out. but I have a, a question. A billion I- fucking lions do not speak don't. to each other. They don't get it. It does, they don't need. Well, no. What they the don't po- get it. The Pokemon. They, this isn't the gonna Pokemon be some. Speak to each other? This isn't the gonna Pokemon be some. Don't. Some like what's that movie where the zombies were like making mountains on top World, of World, War World, World War Z? World War Z. It's not yeah. gonna be some that. The lions some of that are gonna shit. do that. Well, Charizard I mean, can else? fly. Yeah. Checkmate. But he has to stop flying eventually. He can't fly forever. Yeah, yeah but he's gonna run out of PP. You could get another one that's gonna make that. You only got one. Only got one. But you can also. Oh yeah, we've talked about this. There's other ones that fly. We've talked about this flying thing. We've talked about this flying thing. You say Charizard can fly. You fly where there are no lions. Okay, sure, tired. but you know the I'm absence, Charizard? like the the choosing the not to fight at all, is not <laughs> winning. Eventually, he has to land. Yes, and, where there are no and, lions. And as we know, as the rules of war, you cannot have an effective army. There's no rules of war. It's a billion lions. You can't have. There's not going to be any fucking. You can't rules. have an effective. They have gravity. You can't have an effect like. A, a air support will not be effective unless you have ground forces. No, that's just not true. And so, if you have, say, it actually is, Pokemon, or if no, but no, listen, Ted. <laughs> if, not there's, say if, if the battle goes on, and then let's say yeah, Bora, I'm on your side. Okay. What's your but there's only say 35 Pokemon left, but they're flying above the lions. But there's 700 million lions. Fly up the where there are no lions for then a the, second. The, the still, lions are winning. Like there if you always have to choose lions. to fight there. The lions won. Yeah, yeah, to, wait, that's, wait, that's, wait. It's no, retreat. You whittle them down. Whittle them down you're with what? You don't have any Flying PP. away? You, you just struggle. You struggle. Anymore. Wait, yeah. does that mean that if, if Pokemon like in real life runs out of PP, it just like thrashes around until it dies? Yes. Holy shit. Yes. They need help. Because that's what you do when you run out of PP. They struggle. So Charizard's up there just struggling around. He rests. No, he doesn't. He doesn't have that move. Does he what have do that move? Mean? I mean, even if he does, he eventually so runs only do out five, of it. You can only have five rests, and then you can never, you can never go to sleep again. You're, just ta- you're trying to tell me that like 900 of these things have just an infinite stamina to fight a billion lions. I'm saying you go where there are no lions. I don't think you even understand how large of a number a billion away. is. There are seven billion people on this fucking planet and right now. And I don't now, think Ted. you have a concept of how many people that is. And you can go where there are none of them for a minute. You could drive an hour away and there'll be no one. But if there so, were, if all the lions so are we just you. So are we just- And you go back in. So but are we just lost. saying, in it's, your view, you you're just saying that we're going to randomly disperse a billion lines across the planet, an empty planet, and then 900, 900 Pokemon across an empty planet, and then who wins from that? I was under the impression they would all, like, Be drop on a battlefield? In. Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking, like, like, you know, classic 
traditional yeah, like man. one army versus another so battlefield. You're making your own rules. I'm not making my own rules. You're I mean, we, we okay. Rules. Charizard fine. doesn't you, have any you rules. You enacted some other rules from the it's game. The most basic this is rule. War. It's yeah. the most basic it's, rule. It's, it's, it's their logic they operate on, right? And it, let's say you Mega go by Charizard a is ninety feet tall. Okay, he, he can't. No, he can't be Mega Charizard. That's not even true. He can't Mega evolve without a trainer because he doesn't have one of the. Oh my God! We're using part. We're using part of the rules from the game where the battles. Where they can only use the moves from the battles, but also this other part of the game where there are trainers leading no, the Pokemon. No, they need to have a There's special. Very, they need to have a special even though it's bond. part of the game. You don't even yeah. play. You don't even. Know. I don't even play Pokemon. Mega, no. which, which, which I just said. I that barely you're even play the game, and I know that the Mega Evolve thing is like a fucking steroid drug that the Pokemon take. Where are they yeah, going to find that from? Steroid drug of friendship. Where are you going to put Where are they going to find that from? They're going to go. They're going to go and start 90, their own laboratory 90, to make some fucking drugs. If you get to do that, the lions are on ketamine. That yes. 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 The yes. lines get the to be on ketamine. on ketamine. Make it fair. They get to be on fair. horse tranquilizer. That's a, fucking you fuck. that's a tranquilizer. <laughs> that doesn't mean they're not gonna <laughs> I the Pokemon win. <laughs> they're gonna become they're, they're gonna become sentient and they're gonna yeah. be like, wait, we know how to do this with friendship. And then they're gonna they're gonna go through the power of friendship and the lines are gonna form into a giant fucking Mega Lion. No, I can't You've been believe we're still talking about cats. this. No, I can't I believe we're still talking about this. That is exact you just described a battle cat. We're not getting anywhere. We're not the Pokemon can only play like they do in the game, but also this part of the game, the trainer, that yeah, tells Pokemon what to do. Okay, he's not, this, he's not no, part of it, because you can only... When, I'm cherry-picking exactly what I want sense. to make sure that the Pokemon can't win, so I can reinforce sense. my own preconceived opinions about this. You're not even making this. any sense, though. You're not I, even making any sense. I said we're going Mega by the rules. are 90 feet tall. I said we're going by the rules. And then... Which Where's is, the trainer? There is, there is no trainer. That's the point. It's... What, why the Pokemon even fight if there's no trainers? I mean, they're animals. So why are the rules even there? You're right. Well, they why can, don't they, they just live in peace? wild Pokemon, though. It's, it's, why are they it's so mad 900 or so wild Pokemon. Is that what we're saying? I suppose so, well, yeah. But if we're doing the rules, the wild Pokemon, then one li one lion would run into a bush and then have a one-on-one -on -one fight with him. What? Because that's how the game so works. You run into one counter. Pokemon. Yeah, so in that idea, then if you keep fighting lions over and over and you can't heal yourself, then eventually the lions are going to win. Fly. I give up. No, no we're done. We're done. No, fly, we're, guys. I'm vetoing. I'm vetoing. This is ridiculous. I'm vetoing. This is so we're ridiculous. It's because we're half the saying Pokemon the same can fly. This isn't gonna go anywhere. He just keeps saying fly. Half the Pokemon can fly. You are a belligerent child. Do with you think little that... to no good ideas? And maybe, mm -hmm. just maybe, Listen, you should be ashamed of everybody yourself. Everybody in the audience knows I'm right right now, and they are so frustrated that the Pokemon guy does not understand. What? I understand. He doesn't even you understand what understand. you're saying because no, because you just keep saying they're gonna, you're gonna fly feet away. Tall. My dad you used to tell me when I was growing away. up. What? You know, you don't need to tell someone that they're an idiot. Just let them talk and they'll prove. No, themselves. I know, and that's why I said I. This is like saying who would win, you or a bird. And you're like they, it would just fly like what's it? It flies if away. If the bird could fucking kill me, <laughs> <laughs> like a hawk, you versus a hawk. It's you're, it could just fly away. Yeah, you lose every time. Falcon, yeah. So flying. Do you know how much I think, those things have? Listen, one on one. Saw one of those diving the other day. A, me versus a hawk. Yeah. I would. I would probably beat a hawk as it comes in. I'd grab its fucking Do you leg or whatever. Those you would dying. absolutely not hey, beat a hawk. Bora. So I think there's a fundamental misunderstanding. But here's here. the thing. We, Do a, I think a lion would beat a Pokemon one on one? Yeah. No. Can, can we get a piece and if the Pokemon is the one who can fly away? Can we get a piece of info from Borf just real quick, just to about this? Borf, could you just look up real quick how fast? Does like a hawk dive? I think it's. You I think look, it's. I believe it goes at least like sixty miles an hour. You think that you can stop a a, a bird small like like a Full, bird like Tom and Jerry like grab his I've done, neck. I've done one hundred twenty. Sorry, one hundred twenty miles an hour. One hundred twenty miles an hour. One hundred twenty faster than the major league baseball pitchers. You think you can? Listen. It, okay, if you can't. Done, okay, first of all, I've done no, worse no, shut damage. Your mouth. I've done worse Let damage. Let me make my point. Let me make my point. That was that was that wasn't even 120. All right. I've if done you worse. can't, if you can't hit worse. a baseball from a major league baseball pitcher, any of them, because they're all going 80 plus. Yeah. Then you're not going to be able to grab. Oh, but you can only see the hawk when it's 90 feet away from you and closer. Bullshit. What are you talking what are you about? What are you saying? What are you talking? What are you saying? Where's the pitcher's mound? What? The ball only starts there. You see that hawk coming from wherever. You're saying it's a, oh the hawk's in stealth mode. What's well, gonna? It's probably gonna come from behind you or above you. You look. You don't. You never look. Gonna, what is it? What is it? Are you what is above you right now? What is it? No, don't a look. Light, what a is light currently is ceiling? There's literally not. <laughs> There's not. That's not above you. No, directly. You. Like at any moment, you don't know what the fuck is above you. Charizard It'll probably could be, be up there. stupid and go. Ah! What? 
What? What are you saying? And then I'll hear it. And then you'll turn you'll turn around and the first instinct you have when a hawk is dive bombing from directly above at 120 miles an hour <laughs> is you will sw- you will grab it. You will grab no, no, the hawk. I'm not grabbing a hawk. Listen, no, I'm not Where grabbing you a hawk. Grab the hawk. I'm I'm trying to hit it. Listen, I'm with not, what? I'm not with trying a to get punch in, a hawk. I'm not trying to get into a grabbing match with a hawk. That thing. Will, no, that, thing that would be so fucking stupid. <laughs> <You're> so <laughs> fucking stupid. <laughs> Listen, if a hawk grabs you, that thing can crush you. Yeah. <laughs> then why are you trying to say that you would win against this thing? What would you? What, what, so what would you do? We're talking it? about lions right now. <laughs> I don't think he even knows what Schlatt, he's talking about. If you got attacked by a squirrel, you'd be overwhelmed. That's not right? true at all. That's not true. A rabid squirrel? You don't think you? you don't, no, you, I think you, I you don't think you, you don't we were like, actually you, talking you, about this earlier, know, where you were driving and there was a squirrel running away, and we were like. Every time there's ever a squirrel in the road, it runs away. Like, if there was a squirrel running straight at your car, <laughs> like, like in the middle of the road, like, right at you. I'm not talking about, like, accidentally. I'm talking eyes locked. <laughs> <and running. laughs> you, would, you would back up. <laughs> yeah. You would be fucking no, scared. Like, what the fuck, <laughs> what what the the fuck, fuck is wrong with squirrel? That thing can't bite me. That thing could not bite me. Oh, my God. Like, that yeah. would be terrifying. Yeah, that thing climbs into, climbs into the... Into the trunk and then yeah, like well, especially with the especially with the Tesla you're driving, get that thing gets in the front, it's getting into the car. Dude, that thing gets yeah. onto the hole in your car, starts getting at your fucking legs. Dude, 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 chance, oh, dude I'm saying if no, I, I agree with you here. Yeah, you're at one end of the road, you see a small dot w- <laughs> running towards you, and then it, you're like, is that a fucking squirrel? It's like <laughs> not it's slowing going, down. <laughs> I would be like, Holy, what the fuck's going on? Why it's can't not moving? Why can't we like domesticate squirrels and like keep them as friends? Rodents? Ken Jerome Jar did that. Remember him from Vine? Oh yeah, yeah, he yeah. He loved the squirrels. Yeah. Uh, well, were they? They weren't like actually the domesticated. Squirrels? He just yeah. fed them, right? And they he came back for them. food. He'd love on them. Yeah, but He'd they would like them. be on his shoulder and shit. You can do that with like birds and stuff. So too. if you woke up and your girlfriend was a squirrel, then like, what would you do? Squirrels too. It's like a ma- it's so still would... it's a mammal. I feel like it's less alarming than if your girlfriend is a worm. Yes, but you wouldn't love it. You wouldn't love the squirrel anymore. You could still. No, you'd find someone else who could provide you all the care you need because a squirrel can't. You don't. You're not. You don't seem concerned at all about the fact that the your partner turned you seem more into about you. a squirrel. Mm-hmm. Like what's you're done like, is why? Done. What's done? It. What are you <laughs> talking about? What's done is so done. You would wake up. You would wake up next to a squirrel. This is such and a say, laissez-faire. It is, it is what say it is. Say <laughs> There, are, there are things out of our control. It would appear. If I wake up and, I, and yes. someone is a squirrel. Like I, I listen, Charlie. I'm with you. I'm with you that I want to try to fix it, but like, yeah. Listen, I I, there's very little chance I'd fix this problem. My initial thought would be, oh, you're fucked. Yeah. What'd you do if your girlfriend turned into Mega Charizard? I, I I would probably be terrified because it's 96 <laughs> feet tall. Is that really true? Isn't it's that? not true. I was actually going to mention it earlier. Keeps saying, that, it keeps getting taller every time. He's, he's like, all, you, no, you no, he's always said it specifically Charizard 96 is, feet is tall somehow shorter than wrong. me. The average Charizard is shorter than yeah, me. but the big one. Why is it getting... The wait, big one? The big saying, one? You're saying so it's so large. Charizard's like... His like average heart is, is like 5'1". Yeah. So, Connor, yeah. if your girlfriend turned into Mega Charizard, what would you do? I'd be concerned because, first of all, who turned them into Mega Charizard? Because that requires right. like a strong bond between trainer and Pokemon. Oh, And so, fuck. who yeah. is she talking to that she could become a Mega Charizard? Yeah. Oh, Second question. Shit. The second is how Why is, is she, she a Charizard? Charizard? Oh. <laughs> but the first is like, who have you been talking to? But yeah. could you could you love her who's still? Been, who's been training you? Yeah. Hmm. Could, a, could you love a squirrel? Yeah. I have guinea pigs. You could. It's not so different. Yeah, you you'd let you'd go to bed with the squirrel every night and be like, "Good night, honey, I love you," and then it would go like, <laughs> <laughs> and it has two fucking, does. it have two acorns in its mouth. Yeah, it'd just have scraps. And it'd smell like start sh- nesting. It'd, it'd smell like dirt, tin foil, sticks, yeah. and dirt. And you're like, it'd be weird. If you were, so <laughs> <laughs> it seems weird. like a good yeah, transition. Yeah, time. I guess so. Yeah. Um, you wouldn't like that? No, no. No. You couldn't live like that. Humans can't live like that. No, humans can't live like squirrels. No. No. I've never we, been on a podcast before. Like you've this. What? Never been on a podcast like What what do they set. usually talk about on the podcast? I don't know. That's what I'm at. like that's what I'm trying well, to figure out. Well, if you're so out. experienced with podcasts, then what are we well, usually I'm talking about? No, you had something you wanted to say. You had something you really wanted to say. So, Mr. Podcast Expert coming on here telling us how to run a podcast. I mean, I just No, dude, seriously, you have I mean, you have the floor, you know. Yeah, go for it. 
Go for it, champ. Like what, buddy? What do you guys usually do? Because to be honest, I the oh. only episodes I had seen, I'd seen the first Chuckle Sandwich episode. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. then like, because so you guys are all like my friends, and so whenever mm-hmm. I would listen, I'd be like, oh, like. It's kind of just like listening to a conversation of my friends that like yeah. I can't interject with. So yeah. I was like, I don't know, if this is for me. No, you'd rather be here. Like, right. You'd rather just talk to us off off camera. Exactly. Yeah. And so I was like, well, I don't really need to listen. Like it's like not because I don't enjoy it, but yeah. it's just like I like. No, it's, it's like Charlie a, and Freddie's podcast. Sure. And <laughs> <laughs> right. And so <laughs> <laughs> the only yeah, episodes I had seen are now the Freddie episode and Emma's episode. Because you were literally Because I was just yeah, sitting over sitting there. Staring at yeah. us. Just watching. Yeah, just watching. Um, well, it's funny you say that, though, because, you know, uh, Emma's a fan. And she, she... She is. But she doesn't know you like I do, Ted. That's true. I want I want waffled. <laughs> what, is wa- what do you mean waffled? We're holding hands now. Oh, okay. I'm happy for you guys. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Which one of you do you think would turn into the worm? If one of you had to be a worm? What if we were worms together? If right now, if right now a wizard, (laughs) (laughs) right now a wizard, right now a wizard, God forbid, right now God forbid a wizard, (laughs) and one of you had to be a worm, and he said like either of you can, you get to choose who gets to be the worm. Would you choose yourself to be the worm, or would you try and really try and make the other person a worm? I don't know. I'd like. I I would like. Would you be like? I'll do it, Connor. I'll be the worm. I don't. I'm gonna be honest, Ted. Like I. Well, I've already discussed this. Like, I don't think I have the initiative to like really try to fix the problem. I, like, I try you, to bring Connor back. You think you wait, wait, wait? No, no, no. I'm that means you, Connor gets to be the worm. Oh, so you're saying you're saying he would say you'd be the worm, Connor? You'd be like, because well, he's not going well, to. I don't want to be the admitted, worm. You just, but he ju- you just admitted you have no right. initiative to try to fix the problem of me <laughs> being a worm. So, well, you would, so, so clearly, I can't like, trust well, me I just to become a worm. The wizard would be like, Connor, I'm going to turn you into a worm, and you'd be like. I'm not. I'm not confident in any do? of our abilities to fix this issue. So no, like, you can't. Sorry, man. I'm bad at confrontation. Make me a worm. Right. Honestly, maybe if maybe if the wizard was there and he was the one turning your girlfriend into. So this is a wizard that's doing this. Then, now. Yeah. This is, I mean, we well, yeah, we, know, we found the, the guy. Changing. We found the guy. It's a wizard. If you this found the guy, if you found the guy, then my first instinct would be, let's fix this. If, let's let's shoot the wizard. If yeah. I woke no, up, no, because then you don't. You, no one's coming back from a worm if you shoot the wizard. Well, I just think that if you, you gotta trap the wizard. My opinion is, and this is my opinion, so you can't tell me I'm wrong. Is <laughs> is if you kill a wizard, that means that all the things that they did, all those spells they cast. It's just such a bold gone. leap is the only thing. Yeah. No, also, like, what else do they do? You know what I mean? Hmm? Like, what else did you? It's like you kill the I wizard mean, and Charlie, you start fading out of existence. Being the being the resident authority on like anything fantasy, I feel like I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Have you ever, yeah? I've yeah. seen uh, yeah. Harry Potter. Where they, uh, yeah, I've seen Harry Potter. You've seen I, Harry Potter? And do, I. Yeah. Do you remember when, when. That never happens in anything ever. Where, like, someone in Harry Potter it dies. Happens, it happens in everyone, JoJo. Everything they ever did. Jo- JoJo undoes. Bizarre's Adventure. When you, when, you ki- when you kill a guy, all their stand powers goes away. Well, and yeah, but it's not like wizards. everything they ever did goes away, right? No, no. I mean, like, all the spells they did. That's what I'm talking about. Like, if I kill the wizard that turned Connor into a worm and I shoot him, undo. then it would undo his spell. Yeah, but, like, what other kind of shit? I'm just saying, like, what other sort of shit did that wizard get up to? Because, like, he probably did a bunch of other things. Yeah, like, maybe, maybe he solved some problems. Maybe he changed timelines. He probably did. Maybe he's got a... Maybe he Maybe he gifted someone a visual... Visual meter. A visual meter. If you... Connor, if you could have a visual meter anything... Yeah. Visual what would it be? Meter? Yeah, um, they can track whatever you want. What would what would you have? Always, 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 always. Like on somebody up to like see like what other like people. You whatever you have stat. the own meter on you. Oh, my own meter. Like you can always see the meter. It's it can like tell a, you any info you want. Yeah, it's like a Google Google Glass in your Stop. eyeball right there, <laughs> and then you just you just see the the meter, and it can track any stat you want, any trackable statistic. You got to Google any eye. quantifiable value. How much time? Even I have qualitative. Left? Information. How much what? How much time I have left? What? Jesus Ooh, Christ! Wow. You want that in your fucking? Why would you want that? That would, that would make some important in... knowledge. To Holy have. I know, but shit, the closer that's you terrifying. Yeah, God, it's it's. Yeah. I, but what if it was? Bliss, like, you don't even close your eyes. Yeah. Maybe you you're right. See it. But I don't like. What would you track? Not that. But I don't Ignorance know what else. Bliss, man, that's something I would not want to know. You know what I would? Um, like what is what? What do I need to track that isn't like a a feeling? I already maybe how close? Like I would track. um I would, I would, if I could have a visual meter, it would be like something that would be akin to like a spider, spidey sense. 
So like danger imminent. Danger. Danger imminent. So like is if I get what like does that the, count? the danger with that is like what if it's like a really shitty kind of like Tesla you're close to something situation where like a mosquito uh, flies uh, over you while if you're if sleeping. I've got beep, 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 beep. But we're talking about like, you know, this 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 question sort of came from the what if aliens had a visual meter. So I was assuming this is sort of yeah. like alien level quality of technology. <laughs> mm, yeah. Um Yeah, like I think con, that would be if, a good thing cuz like what if a car's coming and then it's like ooh, ooh, Oh, the car missed me. You can just see, there's literally open sensors your, in cars for that, or, or like, like mirrors, the mirrors. Okay. Oh, oh, sensors. oh! Some dude's coming after you with a fucking sharp, broken bottle. Ooh. Honestly, yes, because then you could see the hawk coming. <laughs> Danger, hawk inbound. <laughs> so you admit. So you admit. <laughs> you. So you admit. I'm, just, I'm listen. I think I would catch it regardless. I'm just so saying. So you admit. It doesn't help. It doesn't hurt to have that extra layer of security on you, Connor. What if the predator was jerking you off and the, the meter showed how close <laughs> you were to coming? So what, you admit. What it, oh, wait, wait, I for, what? wait, hang on. The was what this is happening? The, he's looking for a, He wants a the cum predator. meter. I don't know why the predator is involved in why he's jacking slide off. Would you pick but. a cum meter? Well, I'm just, I'm just, I just you choose ask a cum hypotheticals. Right now? I, just ask I know it's a hypothetical, but hypothetically, would you have a cum meter? Cum meter? No, well, it's fine. It tells you everything. It would help. What would it help? Are you telling me that you. Do you deal with premature ejaculation, Shlaz? Is that what's going on? It no, would help so no. you can tell because you can't no, tell normally? I, I definitely don't deal with that. Yeah. But, it, I mean, having Why definitely? Why, why is it so important to... It's actually the other way around. He can't come. Yeah. Mm. So then why do you need the meter? Just, just to see, see how... Just, just to, to understand how far away like, he was. See, see what's going on. Come. Like, okay, well, I got Like, you this see far. it go up a little and you're like... Just to see how far, <laughs> I just got to see how far, far away he yeah. was before he, you know, ran out of energy. It's Dude, probably helpful for like the doctor too. Like, I only make it to like thirty six percent, and then it just yeah. stops. Like, mm, how do I fix yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. I only get thirty six percent of the way to coming. Yeah, doctor. And then nothing happens like, after that. You need to see someone else. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> About like whatever. He's like, oh, you've got the meter. <laughs> Yo, oh, you, so you have it too. Uh, how do you think doctors get their jobs, dude? <laughs> they know when you're gonna. He's come. Like, we could use you around here. <laughs> yeah, I would do. Uh, I would do levels. Levels? I would see everyone's level. Oh, okay. Uh, I want to uh, be Dragon Ball Z. Give me a break, No, not dude. like a power level. It's just like... like What levels, then? What is that? I'd say your levels. It'd be kind of fun, like right? My, like my blood alcohol level? Like what's going on in my... Like a... Like, no, like... What does the like, adrenal gland like do? Like five or six. I don't know. Just like imagine if... Like, you know when you're doing things and sometimes you can't tell if what you're getting that? better? What is the adrenal gland? Like, what gland? if you had like a little... It's, it's what Hillary Clinton does. Pituitary? Yeah, Pituitary? what's that? What is that? Pitu the pitu pitu Are, pitu help. What, what, are you, what are you asking? Right? I don't know. I'm just you, just, you literally cut me off and said, "What is the pituitary gland?" Well, because I was I was curious <laughs> about with the the levels. This was related. Yeah, to what I you're was going to elaborate. Yeah, what are you tracking? What is what level? Yeah, I guess it doesn't track? really matter, Borf. I'm sorry. Yeah, it's fine. It's just like I think it would be kind of fun if like you know you were. So this you looks like a very nice shirt. Do you like this? Yeah. No, it does. <laughs> He was gonna. Don't you, wow. you wish you knew the levels of this shirt? Honestly, like yes. The fiber. What is it? Sixty-seven percent polyester. Yeah, I bet you want to know. <clears throat> so it's like one of those things where, like, say you were getting into a new hobby. Hit me with a new hobby. Hang gliding. You got into hang gliding, yeah. right? <clears throat> All of a sudden, you see everyone's hang gliding level, and you're like, oh, oh like how good they are. Yeah, and level. you see your cell, you see your own level. So you're like, I'm getting like, mm. you see your little XP bar go up. Well, sometimes you can't tell that, if you're good. So at it's anything. like a little bit of a motivator. That's little very bit abstract because you can't. Really is cool. it? Because you cool. could. It could be a meter though. Like, but what if? So whenever you're doing a specific is. skill, so like when you're like washing the dishes, it's like you just see in your vision, like in beyond walls and stuff, like all the people washing. Beyond dishes. walls? That's like I feel like it's a different thing to have like also X-ray. Well, no, I'm just imagining like sort of how if you set like a waypoint in like a game or something and like you just see that specific thing, then I'm just imagining in my head like a roll around you in your vision, you just see like where there's the near like a nearby person that has a level or something. Oh, so, so like you'd see the bar off in the distance. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well that's, that's like wall that's hacks. like a double whammy. That's yeah, wall that's wall hacks. hacks. Yeah. I don't think you'd have that. I think I think the way it'd have to work is yeah. like the person nearest to you, you you see up there, you're like, Oh, their level seventy hang glider. So this is like nose dive. 
Okay. No, because it's not like a social thing. It's, it's like a, it's just like a you. skill or like a. Yeah. Well, then you know, if you're also like looking for someone to do like a hobby with, you could just like start True, knitting yeah. and like look around. But yo, you level fucking. But seven like, what hundred? if it's that abstract? Because there's no real levels for anything. No. What if what if your meter was just like no how much rapport you have with the person closest to you? That could be a meter. I, like, yeah. y it's not like you ever. You know what I mean? Like the cum meter is not real. There's no thirty-five. Oh, well, you can measure that. No, you can measure that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. In a jar. Uh, Not too far. So what? You would you change your answer now? Or no, I want to know. Abstract. I want to know how close I'm how getting. close to coming. Yeah. yeah. Connor, what did you say you wanted to do for a meter? I think I'm the cum meter now. I think really, it, I think really, should. really, wow, a world of possibilities, and well, you want to know how yeah. close to coming you are. Well, now it's weird. No, I mean, if it's, like, two people doing it, I feel like... Yeah, if you guys both have come meters, and then, like, what if it's, like, all of a sudden you're just chatting with each other, and then all of a sudden, like, Schlatz goes up a little bit, and you're like, what the... Wait, fuck? can I... Hey, oh, so I can hey, see what was, Hey, what was that all about? Oh, well, yeah, you can see... Oh, yeah, I can see I, everything. I was oh, it's similar to Charlie's, Ooh. like, you can you see... You can see how I don't close know, I don't everyone see is... Now. You don't... I don't feel like you want to... I don't want to be burdened like, with knowledge. Get, like, that would cause the collapse of society itself if people could see how close everyone was. Just, like, mid-conversation, you're like... Teddy, you, did you just get hard? Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's that is. Yeah, or like there's for some reason you have one friend who's like always sitting at like five percent. You're like, why? <laughs> He's just always ready. He's like, always like revved up. up yeah, that'd be like especially if you if you were it's the like only high, one with that high power, high. it would just be <laughs> such a out of pocket thing to call people out on. It's like yeah. you're just talking with someone you're like, hey, by the way, you just got five percent more hard than what you were before. What an insane thing to like also <laughs> say in a public like, setting. Be like. Like I don't know what just happened, but you are one yeah. percent closer. If to you went, for, if, <laughs> like, if you, if you went for like president, and you were in like a presidential debate, and you were like, you know, debating Joe Biden or something, and you were do like, I would like to <laughs> do not come. Hey Joe, do not come. Like I can tell everyone right now that Joe Biden, hundred percent flaccid. Oh, he liked that a little bit. Now he's five percent. I'm Hello, gonna everyone. Come. Joe, <laughs> Joe Biden is not going I'm to gonna come. come. And like, then you have to like explain that you have that power because other people don't believe it. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, no, no. So I like, think it, I and think then you have to explain that you were offered a choice almost, of what visual yeah. meter to get, mm -hmm. and then you chose the come meter, and like that's why you can see how close going to, to Jesus to like see the miracles. To so like, I don't believe that this guy who's, running for president can can see okay, the miracles. Yeah. Actually, who's no. making these meters? Google, Google. It's the wizard. So this is Google, Google Glass. Listen, Google, this Google, is Google they Glass. They know more about you than you think. But also, I like to change Most my people answer. know more okay. about all of us than we think. I think, here's the thing. If we're tracking vis like stuff that Visual abstract, meter. that you really like can't quantify right now, but yeah, they always say, like, you know, you, you want to surround yourself with the right people. Like, what if there was just a good meter? Oh. You just see how good they are. And then you you can just decide off of that whether Choose or not they're worth your time. That's, I mean, that sounds like a Black Mirror episode. Seeing how good That is your is. social credit. They have that in China. <laughs> yeah. What is, yeah, yeah, what is... How do you get What good? quantifies the good? good? Well, I feel but like also, what quantifies the level? Here's the, here's the thing. Here's the thing. The only situation that I could see any of these things being a problem is if, like, with the cum meter, with you guys both having it, if more than one person has it. Because yeah. once more than yeah, one person right. has it, then it starts to be a, a thing where it's like, what is mine compared to theirs? Like, then it becomes a, like a, a a foundation for judgment. What color is your cum meter? <laughs> it's like I'm rocking a milky, green. a milky. Oh God! White. A milky brown. That would be even more Ew. worrying. Uh oh. Well, hey, imagine it's, imagine if it's like a lottery. Like once you turn 18, you just get a meter. Get now a you're meter? just describing oh. a dystopian. It can just, it can just film. be like it doesn't. You don't know what it tracks, you or can, you don't. You, have to learn you it. just you have, have to yeah. You have is. to fucking figure out yeah. what your meter I is, and love it can that, be actually. anything. It can be anything, and then you're you're like you're waiting your whole life for this shit. You're like, yes, I finally got it, and it's just like, Come oh, here. how far away the nearest lizard is. <laughs> <laughs> and you figure that out the hard way when yeah. or like delayed. or like just like wind speed yeah. <laughs> wind speed so it's yeah. like I guess I can be a good golfer now or something yeah but like you get married and like you see the meter like peak and you're like oh my god this is awesome and like the next day like you run over a squirrel and it went up a little bit you're like what is the what is what is the core? Yeah, like you, you have a straight up like kill what's streak happening? meter. Yeah. <laughs> Terrifying. Dude. A score multiplier, what does this I have a, even I have mean? a UAV this available? This is a good fucking I like setup. this prompt. This you is a just cool get prompt. A meter. This is better than fucking divergent and all that shit. I'll tell you what. Ooh. Yeah, I'm just curious Ooh, what, what the, the story would the be. I mean, sucked. it's like 
maybe you maybe some maybe one day someone gets a meter and it's like tracking something or it's counting down to something and you don't know what it is Ooh. yeah because does it have to be like the same kind of like percentage no, meter or no. could it be like it can anything? just it just tracks a value sure Dude, what if you had like that fucking skyrim compass situation that'd be sick mm-hmm. you could like see where yeah. like, locations of interest around you yeah yeah what i if definitely you just th- had a green you know arrow that was always like a little spinning bit <laughs> <laughs> like, what, what you're you just mean? like wait is it, is it fucking loading and everyone's like i don't know man <laughs> do you, like, do you we, know what this sounds like you. i can't help you but no you're one at five percent right that, now yeah. dude <laughs> this very tangential tangentially 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 reminds me of the giver because um, the, it was yeah, what are they doing that um that was a a story a dystopian novel where everyone the world was in black and white there was no emotion and whenever yeah. kids would become of age they would get a specific job that they would do mm. and there was this one kid that got the job of like the guardian of memories or something like that where he would go That's to the cool. giver and he would receive oh receiver of memories and he would receive all of the memories of the shit in the world oh, from wow. the giver like and actually like understand what color is and emotion and stuff like that it was uh, we I mean, read I, it in, I read is. i read it in school it was one of the books that we had to read in school i don't know if you guys did but no uh, no you guys read glass castle no no Mm-mm. okay i don't I read guess the I'm, outsiders i read the outsiders too pony so boy, did pony boy. Pony boy. Pony boy. Pony so did she they she read the outsiders too i, I mean i've never i've never read, read that to a weird school what's the what's the one what is it what, the one when he's in canada in the canadian wilderness hatchet I read Hatchet. Yeah. I read Hatchet. No, I've um, heard. I've heard stories. Was it a, a look? No, it's not looking for Alaska. Like the Into the Wild one. Yeah, it goes up. Like that. Surely, surely, Lord of the Flies. Yes, I did. Yeah, read I didn't read that. You didn't like read no, Lord of the Flies. I was Flies. supposed to, but I didn't. Really? Yeah. The Dude, Road. I mean Spark Notes. We, I read the road. the road. Dude, I actually read the road on my own, and it, I didn't like yeah, it. Uh, I didn't like the road. There's better apocalypse stories. Oh, yeah. for sure. It's not very Daisy like though. It's kind of cool. It did. I, I mean, it definitely. What got was the, the road? Feeling. It was a father and son, and they had a shopping cart. Oh. It was exactly what it sounds. Like. It was like uh, very. No, I know that one. It was almost like it was almost like just a very middle slice of an apocalypse story yeah. where they were just like fucking existing on the road and like yeah. they, things would happen, things mm-hmm. would take. It was just like event, and they'd be back on the road in an event. It was just kind of like a slow slipping. I remember I, I talked about in the podcast once there was a apocalypse story that I think somebody answered in the comments last time, but I forget what the name of it was. But remember when I was talking about that story where the Yellowstone volcano blew up and then it was a story about this family that had to build this like bike contraption and well, like because all the uh, gas prices were up like a million times and it was like sort of like apocalypse ish uh-huh. where it was like society was at unrest in right. serious unrest but like things hadn't collapsed yet and they had to go on like this bike thing that they built that traveled to like a cabin they had and that yeah. you know there was like some social issues there where somebody had occupied the cabin or something like that I think I read that in school, but I don't know. Do you have like a favorite book, Connor, or anything like this? Favorite book? Yeah, you I fucking really, bookworm, I, bitch. Yeah, you I've like been to starting read. to like read reading. again. I've been starting to read again. I think oh, it really? like helps my head. I think a little bit. But uh, when I was younger, I loved the Hunger Games books, mm. and then I loved uh, yeah. the uh, those changed the fucking industry. Yeah, and I liked the Percy the Jackson industry? books. A Percy lot. Jackson, the Olympians. I love those. Man. They're finally making like good. a series on that. Yeah, Guardians of Gahul, anyone? No. The owl. The owl shit. Warrior owls. No, no. That was because no. of like Warrior Cats, right? That started that whole thing. I have. Like I remember. I had a friend Mason who would read the Warrior Cats books, but I no know. one ever is like, yeah, I read a little Warrior Cats. I didn't, Those people don't exist. I think most either, of my like, reading. W- w- I know either go Warrior full Cats Warrior Cats Cat or, like, or no. Yes, or zero and I can Warrior Warrior tell you Warrior all of them. And most what of my reading just other. ended up being of like Wikia pages of like games I was interested in That's reading, cool. like lore of stuff There's like that. There's a lot of cool fucking lore. Like when I was a kid, I'd be like, oh, I like Star Wars. I just go on the Wikipedia page and just read. Consume. Like, oh, I don't need to buy anything. It's just all here. Right. Favorite like setting or like anything that's always like been compelling for you mm. i don't know i mean i guess i like i like star wars as a kid yeah it seems like you gravitate towards like the sci-fi stuff I gravitate just towards the nerdy stuff i yeah. suppose he's a, he's a big fan of star wars I food it. oh yeah i do like the star wars you eat a pepper with this guy wait is this a question no i forget i was, was just staring was at me on. Yeah, I mean, we could keep doing. It's just my meter was. Starting the to meter flash. started go. No, did the meter go up it a little bit? Flat, and I was just Which wondering. Meter? He's got to figure it out. I don't. I'm don't still know trying to figure it out. Reading level. What if you? This is like a meter. Like how much like fucking oil you drank? You know what I mean? You c- honestly, it could be that shitty. It, it could, could be that shitty. Do you think it would be like the first week after you'd be like doing all sorts of weird 
weird shit to try and figure Honestly, out. Honestly, yeah. You probably would. Yeah. You'd be jerking off a little bit. You'd There'd be, be a, you know what? I feel like would, that would create a class system based on the quality of people. Everybody, the second you like, turn like surely 18. there would but be. But you could a, lie. You could hundred percent lie. Well, but, sure, but surely there would be a meter such as like what someone is thinking. That's not a meter though. That's is not it? a meter. No, no, no. It's the second you turn eighteen, you know every. Well, what defines a meter then? It's like a, just I'm like seeing, a bar. I'm right? seeing a. A bar, either, either horizontal or vertical. Thank I, you. Okay, you get it. I, I just Tick imagine. marks percentage doesn't matter. Yeah. Decimals, fractions. Yeah, where? I was thinking more abstractly in terms of it just being a HUD that tells you one piece of information or nah. one category of information. Nah, yeah. So we're talking about we're talking bars. Okay. Mm. Bars. Well, that's that's cool though bars. because that's a bit restricted. So it it, yeah. it it makes you have to be a little bit more creative. It also means that you could 100 percent lie. So in that, you, yes, you could just but, you but could then claim you could have, have a lie meter. So it's like truth level of someone yes, speaking to you. Yes, but then you have to prove that too. You know, because like, no one because no one else can see it. Yeah, exactly. The thing is, you have that's a unique, still an advantage, a unique though. trait. But the thing is, it has to be useful in the real world, and people have to trust you. Like mm -hmm. it, it, this entire system works on. How legitimate do I think that this person's bar is? How useful is it? I will associate with him based on his bar. Yeah. Here's here's something I, I will say mm. for this question. Someone or a multiple amount of people, if you'd like, try to compress what we're talking about right now and post it on r slash writing prompts. And then on another episode in the future, we can see how we can, people. We can read the one response. We can see <laughs> see what well, they. We, no, no. The honestly, cool so, if it takes made. off, if it takes off, and people are interested in it, sometimes there's a lot of different like little short stories that people will write. And I know. Get, I've I've seen a lot of it. I'm just saying this is one of those things where it could be like, it's either really cool or it's really cool now. Yeah. And as soon as you start to write yeah, about yeah, it, yeah. it's like a the, the only a way meter? I see it going is the second everybody like turns eighteen. Yeah. Every, the yeah. second everybody turns eighteen, they just go and jerk off to see if they well, got the cum meter. But they're, <laughs> I don't know. I mean, <laughs> they need to know if they got it. <laughs> We've talked the about cum, it. Yeah. It's like a li everyone knows it's, it's, it's out there it's, somewhere. It's, <laughs> one no, person, one wrong, living though. person is gonna. You have come it. out of your room the next day, and your father's like, "Did you get it?" I feel like I feel like some people out there, besides the four of us would like have some sort of unique take on like what a meter could be and have that it could have yeah. a significant it's like the cum I, meters run in my family for six generations yeah. <laughs> oh, like, like, get oh no. like it's like it's a thing perhaps like like it's something that you 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 gain through de like genetics and then like mix, you combine you meters yeah so you mix oh. like the how close something is to you in the cum meter and you know how close cum is to you all the time <laughs> 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 like that. Honestly, oh, it's yes. like a mutation of the cum meter there could be yes. like oh, like oh, the companies cum or yes. guilds almost based around impress it like the unique, cum guild yeah. unique builds right like a fucking team fight tactics some bullshit where it's like oh these three people work together they have the meters that like so closely yeah uh complement one another yeah that could be true like like i like a fucking like a little meter that like goes up the more something dangerous is next to you would be like really good yes right stuff like that that's what that's what i was saying the the, the spice sense yeah no that was ridiculous though so. yeah. or like a meter but like a meter that's like how many limbs <laughs> that's not helpful no it's not it helpful. goes down when you lose a limb <laughs> <laughs> and it's you're like, like oh well, like, great that's how it works that's what my meter is no. it's awesome <laughs> it's good how about so these guys are going on a date right now? How about like, like a meter? What? How about like a meter for how thick something is? Oh, that could be I interesting. Think that would be a helpful one. Uh, Connor, you're probably gonna wish you had one of those in a minute here. He knows what's going on. Oh God! Can I pour you? He knows what's Connor? happening. He's watched several of the podcasts. No, he says he doesn't need to. Right? <sighs> Connor, what's your favorite chuckle sandwich episode? Um, he's only watched two. Three. What is this one? I've seen the first one and then two. Is this one your favorite, or is it one with, that's not this one? It's probably Are not doing this an okay one. Job? It's probably not this How one. How could we make it this one? Um, well, it's about to be. Yeah. Wait, this, is this, this gonna might, help? This might make this might it. Help? This is a lot. How much do you think you can th of that stuff you can throw into the air until the air becomes thick? Oh my god, I think the air is kind of thick right now. That's just humidity. Imagine you have a humidity meter and you're like, oh, it's. There's it's apps for that. 50%. <laughs> like, Temperature it's be, outside. It's got to yeah, be something you but can't then just if look you up. If you lived though. in a society like that, then you wouldn't need to have those things, wouldn't need to be created. So you have like yes, they barometer guy. No, they, but they feel like, like let's they still go, would. Let's go head up a barometer guy and see what he. 
some of the the barometer family. But like your infrastructure, the only ones your are. infrastructure totally relies on like. And that's actually that's atmospheric pressure is barometer. I'm pretty sure, but. Why do you do this? Because it's funny. Okay. And yummy. Are you? <laughs> and cummy. And cummy. A little cummy. Yeah. I'm not. We can keep talking. No, about it's that, just kind of like mesmerizing. Been, yeah, while while Schlatt's doing this, here? Charlie, do you have a question for him? Mm. No. Oh yeah, this one's especially <laughs> thick. <laughs> <laughs> not really. How about we no, just do no. it? How, no, how about we just do it? How about? No, it's just it. Oh, it's been getting. Oh, actually, dude. I the don't meter. Oh. Yeah, oh. dude. Fuck. Can I actually give a little stir oh, real quick? Oh, it's like sticking together. This is. Oh, oh, that's actually the thickest I've seen it in a while. It's exquisite. That is wow. That is exquisite. Oh my god. I'm at a hundred percent right now. Delicious, yeah. exquisite. <laughs> nice. <laughs> and ninety nine. Okay, yeah, fair. It's a it's a big jump between that ninety nine. Yeah. Wow. Okay, so Connor. That's come or no come. Mm -hmm. um, Basically. This is I, this is honestly the thickest I've ever seen. Yeah. I, mm -hmm. So you have the honor of I mean like I. Look at that. It's custard it's like thickness sticking, at this point. It's like the, the sticks were like sticking together. We've been getting better about making it as thick as possible. Yeah, yeah it's like, almost I mean, like look a... look at that. I don't you know like what I mean? That. Like, I look at that. Like. No, but you have... It's so just water, man. That, where do we put that? It is just it's just not water. just water. It's, just, it's yeah, water. Yeah. It's water. So, like, if you tilt it, like, look that. at how thick... I mean, seriously. All that. All this is is Walgreens thick now. That is moving slow. Turn it around. You see those ingredients over there? Oh, I'm sorry. You're probably thirsty. Ingredients, food Where starch. You get comfortable? I don't want the food starch in it. It's just water, man. <laughs> it's sure not food. food. Come on, man. The, Come on. The cum meter is going way up right is now. Is it really? Everyone, everyone in Chuckle Week has well, done like, it. Well, like the cum detection meter. Oh, the cum detection. Do you? Is that the one you have? I, I'm beginning to think it is because done it. this is what everyone's it's, done it though. Come on. Has everyone Peter actually done Honestly, it? Honestly, yes. you know what? Honestly, Connor, yes. I like stopped paying attention. You can dare attention. to say no. You can dare to say it no. Would no. The, it would fit the thing. Just like a little bit. Just just to say you did, you know? Oh, I can't. Oh, it smells terrible. No, it's okay. But if you don't, um, you will turn into a worm. So, Connor, it smells like nothing. Dare I say water? Like literally, it's, I started I gagging when I smelled it. I actually don't believe that it smells like water. I feel like you might be hyping yourself smell up it. a little it bit. Does, I'll give it, it like a sniff. It smells like the cup. Honestly. Okay, no, it definitely smells like something. That definitely smells like something. Yeah. The cup? When well, you've been stuffing you a fucking a, you menthol a stick in your nose you the whole time, meter. all you probably can smell is mint. <laughs> He's lost his sense of smell. You've, that boom boom stick is, Honestly, has made he went your... The whole, you, he went the whole episode without taking a boom boom. There's only and one thing I ever saying. need to smell. You got me on that now. Oh, my God. The boom All right, stick. well, you don't have to You don't have to drink the thick water, I suppose. I'll we'll do it. It's too thick. Um, you just... It. Okay, how about a taste? But you do have to answer some questions that we have for you. I put it close, made me gag. Okay. You don't do this, you do the other thing. Okay, I'm turning it. We've never had anyone do the other oh, thing. Oh, it's about to happen. Oh, uh -oh. it's exciting. Here we go. Oh, wow, this is exceptionally <laughs> thick. Oh, he's actually... You, why did you have to chew? Yeah, it looked like you were chewing. He had to chew. He's he was chewing. Exceptionally thick. I think you might have made the right call today, Connor. Yeah. I, oh. He's like getting the gunk Don't, out mm. from in his teeth. It's all in there. You got some serious mobility. That's there, like, man. oh my god, it's really in there. Yeah, I'm really happy I didn't choose that option. <sighs> so now you have to do the other thing. What is the other thing? <sighs> oh man, Connor, Connor, Connor. <laughs> 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 it's like it doesn't even go all the way through. That's fucking fun. For our audio listeners, love you to death. We're dropping a stick. <laughs> into the into the thick water and it it's stopped going, like, before it reached the bottom of the cup. That's crazy, dude. That's so fun. Mm, it's like dropping a stick into like snow. It is. Give yeah. it a shot. It's fun. It's like jiggles around. Jesus. Get, okay. Yeah, even higher, even yeah. higher. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. I'm gonna go. Um. So I guess we can talk after this about that other thing. Connor, oh, what yeah. part of the sandwich are you? Whoa, you just fucking. You really just went for it, huh? You just want to dry. We're deep in. We're deep in time. Um, Connor. All right. All right. He's the mayo. He's the butt ends of bread. I'm the meat. Connor. You're the what of the bread? I'm the butt butt pieces of bread that holds it all together. Connor. So the, so the crust. Well, yeah, I, but the shitty end. Yeah, piece the shitty bad, end bad, pieces. Bad, yeah. Bad, 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 okay. bad, bad. It's like all crust. Well, I guess I'm I'm the inner portion of the bread then. The inner portion of the bread. Maybe doubling Perhaps, up on bread. Perhaps an additional piece making it look like a Ooh, double decker. Is this? Oh, a, yeah. Like this could middle. be a club. Yes. It could be a club sandwich. Yes. 
Is that right what you think makes a club sandwich? Is an additional yes, the, piece of the extra piece of bread in the middle. I've definitely had club. clubs without that. Like yeah, my, me too. Every time yeah, I've had I'm a club that's never had that. The only time I've ever had a sandwich with a piece of bread in the middle is when it's a club. Why do you just like the what? club? <laughs> Going up on a Tuesday. Tuesday. Seventeen thirty-eight is the year in which the tragedy happened. Mm-hmm. That's not true. That was <laughs> hundreds of years later. Oh, you're talking about that one, though. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Which strategy? 2153. I'm talking about the worming. 2153, oh, August 3rd. It began. Yeah, it began. It started. You're not going to You're not gonna like what's going to happen on in 2153, August 3rd. No. 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 That's when they're coming. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's when they're coming. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Meter, meter, tell me. The that's when they're coming. The day the meter stopped working. Yeah. Suddenly oh. everybody was at zero percent. So, I mean, scary. listen, Connor. The great blindness. We had a good talk today. You know, we talked about uh, meters. We talked about Pokemon. Pokemon. We Pokemon's a game. You like, you like games? I like, yeah, I like games. Would you rather have unlimited bacon, mm. but no more games? Or would you rather have games? You know, unlimited mm, yeah. games. But no but more no games. games. So I've heard this question a couple of times now. So you've had time to think, Connor. What? So think. I don't know if I fully understand it. Let those gears it. spin. Let those cogs turn. How do like you me to restate it? How do you have unlimited games? But no I don't games. think he understands the question. Uh, I'll restate it. Connor, Connor try being an active listener and a participant. Let that meter just go. Okay. Would you rather have... Unlimited bacon, bacon, but no more, no games. more games. Or, or would you games. rather have games? Unlimited games, games but, but no, no more games. games. No games for you. You've got no games. It's good. It's it's true. On one you hand, unlimited bacon. Say, but it I've makes got it. you. On the game. other hand, you have unlimited. It makes games. you game. I figured it out. Okay. It's pretty. I'm going. Tame. I'm going to take the latter. Because oh. I, the way I interpret it is, I have unlimited games. What ladder? But now I'm going to stop playing games with not only others but myself. So Whoa. now I have Whoa. unlimited video games. But the games the themselves <laughs> are done. Like He's scary, just holding. I, like I like mentally like. Yeah. Ignore, like I was in, I was answering. Swabs out. Oh. Oh. oh! oh! You saw Gross, that come off that? Uh, what the fuck? Jesus Christ, man! Sorry. Continue. Unlimited Honestly, bacon. I respect that answer a whole lot. Even though it's not what the question was asking, you worked your own little <laughs> logic into it. It was the only way I could interpret it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, you, you interpreted it wrong. Well, how do? What's the? Well, it's interpret- unlimited games, but no games. But no games. Games, unlimited games. <laughs> it's called being quantum. Yeah, but no, quantum. it's not because you have unlimited. Of what them. dimension are you on right but now? But none of them. What? I've been trying to figure it's a that zero out. One, it's, a zero question, a it's a zero and a one. It's a zero and a one. It's a Schrodinger's cat. Unlimited video games. You think there's just a bunch of 4D dudes that are like puppeting us with yes. strings? Yes, yes. You think there's a bunch of 2D dudes we're constantly Murph. stepping on? Don't leave. <laughs> <laughs> I love that movie. It's a good movie. movie I literally like Very good an movie. Interstellar. I've never, I still never seen For it. For some reason, the first thing that came to my mind was that you were talking about Click. So... With Adam Sandler. Click with Adam Which is one of the first movies that made me cry. A true philosophical journey. Just as impactful. He probably had a visual meter at a point. Yes. He did. He no, he totally did. He, did he had really? the volume on his wife. Oh. He that's, literally did. That's yeah. He did. I want the volume meter. That dates the movie. <laughs> I want the volume that meter. That for sure dates. Dude. 100%. Honestly, very helpful meter. Volume meter on whatever you look at. That would be pretty helpful. Boop. It worked. That's crazy. Boop. Ted, you what have you done to me? <laughs> 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 Sorry, Borum. There you go. We, he, Borf just literally took <laughs> Dude, if you're an audio Borf listener, took his, like, Borf Borf took like, his headphones the off. Fuck? There's got to be like the most overmodulation that has just happened to these microphones. So when people listen to this, they're going to think someone came into the studio and <laughs> shot us. It's <laughs> like, like, full on. Oh. Holy shit. Well, um, well, that's about all t- all the time we have. That's about all the... All d- for um, this episode of the Chuckle Sandwich Podcast. But in the beginning... But in the beginning... But in the beginning... Well, we like to do... Well, we like to do... Not in the beginning... 
in the MBD. MBD. Is there another thing that we do? We had a podcast. We um. Wait and so. Oh right, let's roll out the red carpet. This camera, this camera, this camera. Tell the people what you've got going on. Um, I play video games on Twitch. Uh, I I sometimes I've been I've not been doing it lately, but probably by the time this comes out. I'll be doing You'll be it back. Again. You'll be back. I'll be back. Things. And where is it? It's twitch.tv slash Connor Eats Pants. Um, and, uh, about and to YouTube. hit a milli on Twitter. Whoa. I'm about Whoa. to hit a million on Twitter. What's I think your Twitter I might at? go private on Twitter before I hit a million. Oh, really? Oh. I don't think I deserve a million. It's, it's a weird feeling to have to I be like a million people. Get that one M? Yeah. So just like be at 999K and then just be like no more. Bye bye. Ooh. I don't want to. 999.9. Yeah. And then you're like. Lock it up, dude. And if you could lock it up, there in, that'd be kind of legendary. That's what I want to do. Like, I don't, I don't want to hit a million until I feel I earned it. Oh wow! Huh. I mean, I think you've earned it. Kay. But anyway, uh, dude, don't, dude, my don't, meter's at a hundred, bro. Him. I think you got yeah, it. Yeah, no, Thank I agree you. with Charlie. You I think you're wrong. Um, <laughs> <laughs> that's the wrong meter going off. <laughs> yeah. Um, but thanks for coming on, man. Thank you. This was fun. I'll have to uh, maybe next time drink the the thick thing. Yeah, for sure. Oh. Whatever that is. Well, you'll have to do the other thing after The other thing right after, after the this. podcast, but for now, thank you guys so Bora, are you at twenty percent? What the fuck, man? Yo, Borif's at twenty right 20%? now? Twenty percent? Wow. Oh, I might he's got a little chubby. Borif, twenty one? I like my job. <laughs> <laughs> thank you guys so much for listening to the Chuckle Sandwich Podcast. And we will Chuck you later. Chuck. Yo. Is that something you say? Uh, we just kind of change every time. You do you want to yeah? say like the one that we have this time? I switch up the word. I kind of, I kind of think we're gonna chuck you later. Is pretty direct and kind of. All right. Shall we all point at the camera and say chuck you later like we're part of a show? <laughs> chuck, chuck you later. later. There it is. Connor, Beautiful. ninety-five right now, man. I got. I like really like chuck you later. <laughs>